Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Infection Free Zone. So we're playing in Perth, Western Australia, and uh, we, I don't, know, I don't quite know how many days we've survived. Uh, somewhere they must say it, I don't know. But anyway, we'll continue to do our thing. So we're getting through the night. Um, it sunrise, it's at 6.07, so it's almost sunrise, and so we need to... Um, scavenge a bit more and I think I'm going to go after weapons today but also there's a, a, a lot of other building activities that we need to kind of undertake so one person uh, grab the, the truck for me please uh, ooh, I need to unpause this so grab the truck get out of here a little bit okay, get like that uh, what do we need in terms of so it's been a day or two since I've played uh, I am loving it though so we need to get this thing built I'm pretty sure that will finish today then we need to move on over into um, into the research center there's a lot of stuff we still need to scavenge we could now remove these guards I don't have guards during the day um, it's a bit of a waste I'd rather have them work um, and then we've got plenty of stuff that we need to scavenge and we need to kind of finish off building. So let's, um, uh, shall we start the build here? Do we have the, we have everything we need. So let's, um, let's add these people to the mix. So we'll get this one built. So these two will be building today and the rest is a lot of scavenging that we need. So, um, it's looking pretty good, but we do need a little bit more with regards to the, the, the lumber. So we've got a, a few people there. So I think I'll, I'll stay probably with three, right? Oh, there's a few, only a few here and a few there. Um, and this should finish and then we'll move on over to that one. Maybe we'll, uh, let's just band, let's just band one more group here. Yeah, one without anything there. And then what we'll do is we'll, we'll actually add them to, to some of these foraging. So let's add two people there and two people there. So let's just get a little bit more scavenging going on. And the next group uh, we have is we'll get into a vehicle, hopefully a big vehicle, excellent. So that's the plan. Okay, now let's zoom out uh, for a second uh, and quickly establish where we're gonna go scavenging today. So one group will is, will sca scavenge close. Ooh, let's pause it. So that's the working day started. So one group is gonna scavenge close. So we've, we've got some extra firepower nearby if we need to. The other one, I think it needs to go and have a look for some much needed additional weaponry. Uh, this isn't actually loading, but it's not that important to me right now. I am looking for, oh, there we go, loading. Just a little bit of zoom required. I am looking for um, a uniformed facility. So something like that. We've got two over here. We have something a little bit closer. We could go swing by and pick up some stuff over here. How about over here? We should have something over here. There's something over there suggesting we might find an assault rifle in that location. Uh, there's, a, uh, there's a bit of a hardware store over here, which uh, isn't something that is quite useful. There's something else over here. A bit of a look release station or something. Nope, does not seem to be the case. Um, and also maybe up here, anything? Oh, this area is completely like, we can't see what's going on there. But you wonder what some of these are, because, because these areas, we should be able to actually come and, come and have a look at these areas. I wonder if there's a different dynamic popping in, because we've recently been here. I'm, I'm, it looks a little weird, actually. Anyway, doesn't matter. Okay, what we're gonna do, we're going to get the truck to come down to this location. It's not a stormy day or anything, right? No. So let's um, let's get the truck to come down this area. Oh, we need to click it first, right? Operator. Here you go. Make your way over here. On my way. Just get it to drive there. It's interesting that it's uh, using um, the, the bigger roads, like actual traffic works. And then the other one, we're just going to try and scavenge a little bit more around around this location. We could do with a bit more research, I think. Maybe that's something we do. We're pretty good on food, five days with the food, but that'll run out really quickly. So we do need to um, continue that journey. Anyway, let's um, let's continue. Actually, let's scavenge something on some of these things on this side because we're going to. Um, demolish some of these things as well, uh, scavenge them. 
So let's uh, head over over there, and what we'll do is we'll just make our way down down that road there a little bit. Okay, let's uh, let's do that and, uh, and keep an eye. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click this squad, so I've got them um, selected if something should happen. Okay, uh, is the transmission coming in? Chief, we just found a dead animal, but. The thing is, it was literally shredded to pieces. It couldn't just be some ordinary infected. Okay, so we, we, we're going to constantly find some stuff that's going to get people to uh, worry a little bit. Stay alert. Uh, and we're just going to kind of breeze through that, and it'll it'll trigger some events, and uh, you'll see how it works. We're not going to go in and spoil it for you, uh, but, but I have seen some of these things before. Uh, not everything, but I have seen some of it. Uh, I've only played a little bit to kind of get used to what what this is all about. So anyway, that's and that's kind of why we explored as well, so we kind of see what's going on with some of these things. Um, the day is looking pretty good. Uh, we would want to get out here pretty quickly because it's a decent distance. It is seems to be saying it's winter, but 22 degrees is not that cold. We'd still be farming, right? Our farms is producing. Yeah, absolutely. Our farms are producing, so that's absolutely fine. This cookhouse really needs to finish off now. At least it is busy doing its thing. And these guys are scavenging over here. Okay, cookhouse should be very close to being done. Ooh, look at this. A tanker. Oh, no, no, no. A truck. We're picking that up. We're definitely picking that up. Um, a truck could have lots of storage for us, so that's pretty cool. And another... Um, pickup truck over here. Okay, excellent. So we'll get uh, this crew nearby. Now we've got another transmission, so let's pause it for the transmission. Chief, we just found an assault rifle. Oh, so beautiful. Handy against large hordes. Let's <laughs> just not waste too much ammo on nothing. <laughs> beautiful. I love Use it. it with caution. Uh, that's good. That's very good. Picking up an assault rifle, and hopefully we'll get another one from... Um, from where we've gone over there. Is this guy down? No, still still scavenging. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. A soldier rifle with some ammo and some food. That's a pretty good spot right there. Okay, now, getting back to the action over here, we're hoping to get yet another one on this side. So we'll probably leave this pickup truck over here and take this truck to, uh, along. One of the things you can do is you can actually send out your squads to go and scavenge um, some of these adjacent tiles, right? Not Not like directly like we're doing it now, but you can kind of scavenge them by just sending a vehicle out there for a number of days to go and do it. And I'm thinking that truck is going to be really handy for uh, doing exactly that kind of thing. So now, with, uh, with nothing too, with, with things being pretty keen, oh, wow, you're going to park? That is ridiculous. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Why wouldn't you just park on the road on this side? Anyway, so scavenging, it seems pretty safe, so hopefully we'll get some... Clear some equipment and stuff over there. Okay, so these guys have cleared a building, uh, loading everything in the car, and hopefully they're now moving to the next. Yes, they are. Okay, excellent. What's going on over here? Why is this cookhouse not done yet? We're waiting on two more pieces of metal, which we've got. I'm just wondering why you're struggling. Can we just just go and grab it. It's right over here. Grab it and build it. I just need the cookhouse to be done before we get to the end of the day. Ah, there we go. Building is happening yet again. This is also progressing, so that's absolutely fine. Excellent. Okay, good haul today with regards to, um, to uh, weapons. Weapons is really good for us to uh, be able to continuously defend ourselves to the ever-growing ever strength of the horde. Adaptation is complete, so the cookhouse is done. Let's pause it for a second while we quickly have a look. So at the cookhouse, what we can do is we can either use um, grains plus some lumber or wood or whatever they call it in this game, um, and then we can turn that into four rations, and that does it in about two and a half hours, which is pretty good. The other option is meat and uh, wood actually at a reduced time and gives us five. So that's really the one I want to go for, but I don't have any meat just yet. So that's something that we'll probably get into. At the moment, what is this? De-adapt de the building. Oh, good. I don't even know that's an option. So uh, how much grain do we have? We don't have a lot of grain. So what I might do is I might just um, reduce this down to like, now it's five hours. So let's reduce that. And what we'll do is we'll get 
uh, th- get started on this one. So now I'll pull people off. What are we looking at over here? Metal is pretty good. Everything is about equal. I might pull a couple of people off of this and add them here. And maybe one more off of there. I do want to keep going on the wood. And let's get started on adapting our research center. That's that's pretty pretty important. Uh, we've got a f- four people in there, so we'll we'll start working on our own rations as well. It's good to to have that going, but we don't want to you know, overcommit too much um, because we don't need that much. We're still collecting a lot of canned food um, around, so that's that's all good in general. I think um, let's do it. Doing pretty well. We do need to get the research going. So luckily, we we have a team um, that's now going to start building that for us. Okay, uh, these guys are scavenging, hopefully picking up more ammunition and stuff, so that's cool. They can continue doing that. Let's go down here and see how these guys are going. Um, oh, they are done. And uh, I didn't even notice that. Ooh, so that's really not great. Uh, there's another one over here. So let's come and do this one. There's still a bit of time left in the day. So we scavenged that one. We've got another pistol, which is not quite what I had in mind. I wanted something a little bit more, um, a little bit more beefy, like an assault rifle. Uh, at least we got a lot of ammo out of that. That's a, that's a fair, that's a, that's a number of nights of defenses, I think. Uh, so let's get cracking on this one as well. And then on the way back, we'll pick up the truck and we'll, we'll head back. Hopefully, in uh, not too long, even if it has to run into the night, we'll do that. Building clear. Excellent. So how's this looking? Yeah, that's not bad. At least we got the assault rifle there, which is a, a, a good sign for us. That'll help us a lot. Clear. Um, also with defending against um, others, you know, there's uh, there's some bandits here as well. The hordes isn't the only thing you need to be mindful of. That's why I'm actually having a group fairly close by. Um, okay, so it is getting no more to, find. to the end of the day. So let's uh, let's quickly pop down and see how these guys are doing. Yeah, we're going to have them finish off the scavenging. They found another pistol, which is okay, which is okay, I guess. Uh, but we really need um, a little bit more than that. I wouldn't mind. Two assault rifles would be awesome. We'll keep looking until we find the assault rifles, really. I'm keeping an eye on these guys. These should be able to finish off and get back. That's the end of the day. Okay, so now with that at the end of the day, what I'll do is I will basically start removing a few people. Oh, that's already removed a fair bit. So let's remove two over here, put them in the tower straight away. Uh, so that's a good starting point. These guys are finishing off their scavenging. So once you're done there, uh, I might want to get you home, actually. Uh, darkness is not too far away. What a time is it? Oh, yeah, very close. Uh, they're pretty close, so they won't. That's not going to be a bother. Let's just quickly go down and and make sure we keep we babysit these guys. How far are they from from being being done? Uh, they're almost done. Excellent. Uh, so unfortunately. No assault rifle. Okay, good. Let's pause it there, and there's an incoming transmission at the same time. Sir, we found a trail nearby. It looked as if a huge crowd had run and trampled everything in their way. There must have been hundreds. Yeah, so more of these things. Have you heard anything? Anything else? Let's just do with that. Is there anything else? Last night, we could hear howls. Operator, on as my way. Crowds of monsters were shouting and wailing. I think something really big is coming our way. Look for more signs. Track them down. Okay, so uh, we're um, getting some warnings that there's going to be some some big crowds making their way into our general direction. Let's uh, get moving. I do want to get this going. But let's pop up here quickly and just get the other squad home, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. All good. Um, so that's fine. You've got most things there. That's okay. Just uh, just make your way home um, so we can make sure to have a squad at home. And then we can obviously do a few other things in there too. So, excellent. Okay, good. Let's pause it there. Operator. I'm kind of 
tempted to disband and get a new squad going. Yes, excellent. So that's good. Now I've got the assault rifle ready in there. And do I get another squad? I don't have any workers available, which is okay. I can just um, just uh, drop them off of something like this. So let's pull them off of there and add another squad. Oh, actually fully weaponed up. Um, you can grab a car and and help us kind of uh, kind of kite guys around. That's kind of what the, the term is, I think. Everybody is calling it. Okay, so these guys have arrived here. Now what we'll do is we will split off a little group. We'll make it two of them at least, so um, it's not too lonely out there. And we'll get the this squad out of the way. Operator. Out of the way, and then we'll We're on the move. sort out the, um, the, uh, the the truck here. What is this called? Just the truck, yeah. Look at that capacity, 40 capacity. That, and then this one is 20. So it's double. Um, double what this one is. Okay. Vehicle is taken over. So let's um, grab these two squads and get them back home. All right. Uh, hopefully they're not going to draw too much attention driving, uh, driving up here. And we'll kind of, in this view, keep a bit of an eye on them. These guys should shout out if they see anything. We just want to keep these guys um, in check. This truck should be a lot slower than the other one, but, um, but we'll keep an eye. That's good. This is a good uh, a good find down here. It'll help us. They will tell us when they see something too, by the way. We don't have to really babysit them. Um, I could I could maybe send this squad out um, out over here to come and pick up a little bit more. Oh no, I cannot. Um, and it's good that I'm I'm seeing the action here. We're on the move. On my way. Are we gonna are we gonna engage here? Let's do it. We're on the move. Going there. Okay, so we're coasting them or kiting them. And now the uh, assault rifle is busy opening up. That's gonna be pretty good. We're gonna manage that pretty easily, I think. Okay, we've spotted another horde, and the question is, is it here, or is it my other group? Uh, who? Okay, now, I wonder, will they drive straight through them? Let's, uh, let's grab these guys. I want to see them. If they go full speed through them... Okay, that's wasn't probably great. The other truck will get them too, I think. Let's do it. Roger. On my way. On my way. Excellent. Going there. Truck is doing a bit of damage over there. Excellent. That's good. We are Excellent. That's awesome. That's awesome. We managed that one pretty well. Let's get these guys to come over here and get a little bit of science for us, if we can. Um, things should be pretty calm. We should be able to manage anything that happens over here. No problems. We'll continue to do a little bit of scavenging um, in the evening. We could do a little bit more, to be honest. Let's um, disband these two and we'll just recombine into one. So let's give me one squad instead, and yeah, yeah, yeah. just grab me the pickup way. truck, please. Let's Going there. And let's find whether we um. Ooh, it's a little bit on the wrong side of things. Is there much more to do on this side. Let's, uh, let's just do that one. We'll, we'll go and grab some uh, canned food over there if uh, that's okay. Oh, no, 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 here we go. And these are dogs, look at that. Heads up, there are some infected dogs incoming fast. Okay. Shoot them down. Okay, so they are, um, they're, pretty, they're pretty challenging, these dogs. Uh, they're not too bad, but... Um, but we do need to be a little bit more mindful of them. They shouldn't. They are much quicker than than the norm. 
Going there. And we do need to just Going there. Attack. They're trying to get inside. And this is where now I'm screwed up big time here. Going there. Just yeah, yeah, don't don't try and that was a that was a disaster. Look at this this uh this guy is is out of um out of steam. We really can't afford that. So what I'll need to do is potentially just go and grab another one. That's our only um, pickup truck, is it? There was another one down there. It's not the end of the world. And we could fix it with like five metal. But at the moment, metal is a little, worth a little bit more than a car, I think, um, until we get its themes flowing a little bit better. So that wasn't ideal. What I'd rather do now is I'll come and park it over here. Um, and just get out because this isn't going to be very useful to us. Let's just park it right over there and we'll kind of remember that it's not um, not ideal. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grab the truck and move it out of the way. There's this thing where everybody just parks right in front of the door to unload and they don't give each other room and then we kind of get the vehicle stuck there a little bit. What I might do is I might just bring the truck over here a little bit more because the truck will have its very own kind of unique feature and we're not going to use it for, for much, I think. Um, and then I think this car, we had some damage to that as well, but that's okay. Let's just park that one over there. That's ready to go. No, no, no. Park the car there, get out, and the other one can, can just be there. And they're all in the reasonable condition. Is This truck is the, is the worst. Is the worst. So actually, do we, do we go and grab a little bit of extra expansion? Uh, no, I'd like this guy to get into the car there. And with a bit of luck, we can go over there and get some some stuff. All right, they should shout out when they see something, right? So we shouldn't have too much trouble here. These guys are almost finished their scavenging. Excellent. They've done that. They've got two more signs, which isn't a bad thing. Uh, there's plenty of signs to be had, but I may just do another one while we're here. Keep an eye out for hordes, and if there's anybody in there, that's okay. That's fine. I think we're managing it pretty well. There is a horde coming. Now, we'll keep a close eye. Yeah, heading my way. Yeah, that's... Oh, maybe not heading my way. Just kind of prowling about. You just need to keep an eye on them. They're getting pretty close, though. Uh, the sun's going to... Catch them pretty soon, I think. Ooh, they're getting really close. Going building to building, are they? Uh, hang on. These guys done? Reporting. Uh, can you... Let's do it. Yeah, let's do this one. Oh, don't do that. I don't, I don't like that. That's, that's not ideal. Uh, let's do this one. Add ward. I want to finish... Ooh, they, are they going to see me? Question mark. That's the end of the day, right? They, I don't think they'll get all the way to our base. Uh, I don't think they're going to be too problematic. We can actually go in and take them out if we wanted to. So what did we grab? One can of food there? My goodness, that's not, that's not ideal. That's not ideal. So let's, uh, let's come over back here and come and drop it off. I don't think they've even spotted us. They will be going into one of these buildings over here. Somewhere over there we'll have a ward stuck in a building. Okay, so we've got that one uh, got home pretty easily. These guys, let's continue the scavenging and get all of this, um, this scientific material home. That'll help us quite a lot when we get our research facility up and running. Okay, so now we're starting the day. Um, I'm going to grab these guys. The assault rifle is going to stay here. So these guys get into, get into the station wagon. It's a little bigger, okay? And what we're going to do is we're going to go towards another uniform facility. So let's zoom it out. There has to be, yeah, another one over here. So let's um, let's drive over here. Let's actually look a bit closer than the other one. Uh, let's drive over there and find that spot. These guys are clearing out the building. That's good. So we can, we could do another and take this home or... Yeah, what I'll do is I'll disband this group and put a few more people back onto this uh, job here. 
And the rest, I think, can all just go this the way it is. And what I'll do is these guys can continue um, to pick up a little bit more scientific material. That's going to be uh, a useful um, a useful activity for us. Okay, excellent. That's very good, very good. Uh, actually, a pretty calm um, couple of days. I'll uh, I'll go for one more day, and then we'll uh, then we'll call it an, an episode. Let's see if we can't find a little bit more with regards to um, um, some firepower. Any other facilities here? Oh, there's another car. Not that we need one right now. We we can find more cars if we need if we need them. There are cars all over. But we'll keep keep looking at that. Uh, these guys are busy scavenging, so that's okay. I've got an eye on them. Um, the construction activities are underway. We really need do need to start planning out what we're going to do with the rest. Ah, at the moment we don't have a squad here. Ah, you know what? We need to um, drop off the people over there, and that's going to yeah, that's fine. Just so they can continue to help and support some other activities. So, for instance, I wouldn't mind getting more people onto that, so we can clear that metal. Uh, the metal out. Oh, there's another truck over here. Pick up. Another pickup over there, which is uh, probably useful to us in the sense that we've already lost out some. Uh, well, well, our other pickup truck is uh, is pretty close to being, being um, you know, completely destroyed. Uh, it's clear, so hopefully we'll get, uh, get something a little bit more meaty in there. That's fine. These guys. The day is pretty good. I'm hoping we can finish this one off. But pretty slow with some of the construction activities, really. Really quite slow. And that's one of the things, right? In this, the mood is satisfied. And so at the moment, we're not getting any big, um, any big boosts at the moment. We would like to get some boosts out there so that we uh, get our, um, our productivity up. Okay, let's uh, Ready for keep an eye on this. Hopefully, we'll get some good weaponry here. A second assault rifle will be really useful in defense against uh, a number of different things, including raiders. We haven't really seen much in, in that space. So yeah, it's been pretty quiet, actually, uh, which is good, which is good. It gives us a little bit of room to get ourselves established and ready to defend and the likes. Okay, I think these guys will continue to scavenge. These guys will be done any time now. Yeah, any minute now. How much did they get? Clear. Absolutely nothing. Okay, well, what we'll do is let's uh, let's drop off the stuff um, at HQ. We've at least got like six additional pieces there. That's up to 13 scientific. We can do a lot of research with that. So we really don't need uh, much more in that space. So what I'll do is we'll get them back into the car now that we've got that dropped off and I think what I want to do is try and clear this building out. So go around and we should be able to do uh, a little bit of damage here. Wait, is this a, this car seems quite slow. Anyway, we've got enough cars for what we're trying to do at the moment. So keep scavenging that. That'll take us quite a while to get done. Um, let's get back over here. These guys, wow, slowly scavenging. What kind of stuff do they have? 10% scavenging speed on all of these. Oh, it's the same thing. I thought they had different things. So anyway. Okay, so we do want to kind of level them up a little bit over time. Make sure they don't die and keep them in squads and stuff like that. Best we can. This is almost done. Oh, we're actually waiting on a bit more wood here. Hopefully that can get done. And these guys are, ooh, I like it, I like it. We're gonna have some grain come through. We just had uh, a bunch of, um, a bunch of rations done. I like it, four days with the food. I like it, I like it. We out of grain? Okay, well, if we're out of grain, then take them off there and put them onto this activity so we can clear that out a little bit quicker. Um, that's fine. We're getting close to clearing all of this out. That's okay. We need to start planning what our what our defenses are going to look like. We're still, I think, we're still okay for now. But oh, there's an assault rifle there. Excellent. That's exactly what I wanted. I like it. So that's been quite successful. And over here, we still don't know what's in this building. We haven't yet found anything. Excellent. So that's good. 
Uh, I think this is moving along pretty nicely. We just need to start looking at what our defenses look like. So let's talk about that a little bit. Um, we could use buildings, right, to kind of be walls. They can't actually, they don't actually go through buildings. So we could use buildings to a certain degree um, to kind of act as walls so that it costs us less to build because this entire front stretch will need, will need a wall. And I'm guessing this entire back stretch over here will need a wall. Uh, we need to look at where we're going to place gates, probably about four gates, one on each side, and then some corner towers and, and the like. So there's a fair bit going on. Uh, we're getting to the end of the day. So yeah, so I'm thinking, I'm thinking something like up against there, down here, down here we could use this row of buildings as a wall. We could use this building as a wall. That gives us these buildings to adapt for ourselves. Keeping it small, I think, is a good thing because it means that uh, we can respond pretty effectively. And we can always, um, you know, go wider later. I'm probably this is going to be the wall. I don't think we're going to go into this area. It's just too dense. Uh, but what we might do is we might expand it over this way and over that way, so things like that. So we might go from here and expand it into here and incorporate a few of these buildings um, and that might be what we do. We just kind of keep these buildings around. We don't scavenge them. And even these. Uh, yeah, so the question mark I have is how far do we go? And maybe I think initially we just go up to here, use these buildings. And we still have these and we can partially adapt, right? We've still some big buildings we can partially adapt. So I think go up to there, go up to here, and that's, and that's kind of going to be it. The only thing is we just need to make sure that we have a defensible kind of view here. So maybe a little bit further away um, over on the other side of the um, of the rail tracks, really, so we can put a tower in there that can properly defend in each direction. More, even Maybe even two towers or even a gate there. The gates um, are a little bit better at defending than the towers. They like, uh, have more people in there. Okay, all good. Let's, uh, let's get back to our people and see what's going on over here. Receiving. Still underway with the scavenging. Uh, it's going to be the end of the day now, and this is still underway. I'm thinking we need to... Start Start okay, that's the, that's the end of the day. We're not going to finish anything more. How far is this? We've got one more piece of wood needing to come over here, and then we'll finish. So we'll definitely finish this off tomorrow. We're not doing any cooking at the moment. We can probably do some cooking tomorrow. Um, okay, so now I'm thinking... Oh, we've actually picked some stuff up, but I'm thinking we uh, we we get this uh, this uh, gang home. So let's get them Roger. down here, just so we've we've got that going for us. We will pull a couple of people off of this and get them into the tower straight away. But at least we we've got some some visibility, I think. Okay, that's fine. We'll uh, get these guys checked out. Yeah, yeah, let's just get this, this group here. Uh, we should have the assault rifle here, right? Yeah, so we can we can get a new group uh, formed as well, actually. Uh, yeah, well, let's get them to drop their stuff off, and we'll get them to park out over here. We'll pull a few people from something else. Oh, yeah, that's, that's kind of slowly dropping off anyway. So we'll pull... Three off of that and one off of this, and we'll add another squad with the assault rifle. Excellent, that should be good. So that's going to give us um, pretty reasonable activity here. Uh, ooh. We've got some stuff happening over here. So we're a little bit cautious. We just need to keep an eye on them. I don't think they'll attack us while we're scavenging. It's basically on our, once we're done and we're loading up the car, where this might become a little bit of a problem. And then, of course, we want to keep an eye on our home base over there. We're not too far away, so we should be able to get there. We're not picking up any cars on the way, so we'll just drive straight there. This group is way too close. Scavenging is taking a long time. It's evening. These guys are roaming the streets, and they're getting pretty close, so they will they will probably see us when we, uh, when we load the car up as it stands at the moment. I hope we can get this finished before uh, we get a horde spotted at HQ.
and should be done. Excellent. Lots of ammo. They're not seeing us. They're on the other side of the building. Okay, now that's that's a good haul right over there. So get yourselves back over to base. Going there. Um, driving through might uh, attract a little bit of attention, but we should be way quicker than them. Even if they do start chasing us, we'll uh, we'll be out of here before they even notice. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. We might see someone else along the way. That, that'll happen to you, you know. But they'll they'll, they'll shout out. So it's it's pretty good actually. We do need to get that research up and running, but I think it's probably where we're going to end this episode. We had a good haul in terms of um, weaponry. Weaponry is looking pretty good for us at the moment, so we should be able to defend ourselves pretty nicely against most things uh, now uh, until we get our defenses up. We're in a pretty good spot. This is, uh, is, is bothering me that this is not just getting built. It's problematic. Sometimes I think, I, I feel like it helps if you uh, reassign people. Excellent. So now our weaponry is looking pretty good. Uh, this is spare weapons at the moment. So we uh, practically have enough for four fully armed squads at the moment. That's, that's not bad. That's not bad. Guys, I'm going to leave it there. Um, and I wouldn't mind seeing you back in the next episode. Do tell me if you like this and if you want us to continue. I'm going to do a couple more episodes at the very least, uh, just because I'm having so much fun with it. But do uh, do tell me if you would like to see us go a lot further with this, finish off this kind of story, um, things like that. I'm not, no, no, no guarantees, but let's see what, uh, what you have in mind. Okay, uh, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.